A keen triathlete, Evie Eglinton's life changed forever 10 years ago after a freak cycling accident. Ran into a pothole, flew over the handlebars, pretty much pin dropped straight over onto my head. She spent four months in intensive rehab. After that amount of time, with no movement and only a bit of sensation, I knew that I wasn't going to be walking again. Around 50 South Australians suffer spinal cord injuries each year, but current imaging technology has its limits. One of the difficulties we've got is trying to establish um, whether these individuals have a good prognosis or a bad prognosis. Now researchers believe using a new technique with a PET scan will give a clearer picture of what's happening inside the body. A chemical is injected into the patient and highlights exactly where the injury lies. And as we continue our treatments, we can continuously scan these patients um, and see how well they're doing or if any changes need to be made to the treatment regime. SAMRI researchers are looking to recruit 24 individuals to take part in a two-year trial. The scope is wide. Patients can be aged between 18 to 75, but their spinal injury must have happened at least three months ago. It won't change the prognosis for Mrs Eglinton, but the scan's providing hope to others. A scan like this may have made all of the difference. Maybe I would know whether I'd be able to walk again or not, but because I didn't have that option, the idea of rehab was to get you independent and out. Gertie Sperling, 7 News.